Soldiers from U.S. Army Japan and members of the Japanese Ground Self-Defense Force took part in a course at Sagami General Depot recently designed to help them learn and then teach others on the Improvised Explosive Device Effects Simulator, or AIDA system. It is a uh, simulator that simulates IED explosions and how to react to them. So initially they, they do a classroom portion that kind of talks about the different components, then they go into the uh, setup portion, and then it culminates into kind of a full-on exercise type where they actually use the system and the effects of the system. AIDIS consists of manual and wireless trip wires, booby traps, and control devices meant to simulate the IED threat. Once enabled, they are hidden and put to the test. A suicide vest simulator is also a part of the AIDIS training. Some soldiers might not know how to react once a member of their squadron or squad is attacked by an IDD or by a suicide vest or walking through the jungle and hit by a tripwire. It's a good uh, tool for soldiers to learn how to react accordingly and uh, get their casualty or their team out there safe with the proper care that they may need. The more they know before they go to the theater or wherever they're going to go, uh, the better they are at staying out of danger and, and taking care of themselves and their soldiers. For U.S. Army Garrison Japan Public Affairs, I'm Rich Fagler. Thank you very much.